Hello guys, welcome to the debug arena. In this video, I am going to show you that how can you upload your code to the GitHub and also how can you host your HTML website onto the GitHub pages. By doing this, you can access your website from anywhere, anytime and also you will have the backup of your code. One important thing that both these two are the different aspects like you can upload the code of any languages onto the GitHub but you cannot host the code of all the languages like you can only host the HTML website onto the GitHub pages, not PHP. For PHP, you can use Heroku. We will talk about that in the, some other video. But in this video, we will only going to host HTML website. So without any delay, let's get started. So the first thing is, I am assuming that you had already downloaded the GitHub on your local computer. So to check whether it is downloaded successfully or not, just go to your CMD and run git version. So if you got this, then it is downloaded successfully. Now we can move on. So come here at github.com, click on sign in. I already made my account. So I will log in. So you can see here, this is my dashboard. So the first step is to create a repository. So just click on plus icon, click on new repository. Go here, give the name of the repository. I will give certificate generator you can see now uh, name is acceptable keep this public and just click on create repository so the first step is done and this is my website which i am going to host and upload the code so first go to your project directory this is my project directory come here open cmd so the first step or the first command is you can see here these are the command you have to run first command is git init it will initialize the git repository in your folder. So you can see here that now dot git has been generated. Previously it was not there. Now the second second command is git add dot. It will add all your files to GitHub. And now you have to commit. You can just give it any name. I will just give first commit. Okay. Now it has checked all your files and made uh, it in the github now what you have to do now you have to come here and change the branch so you can see here this command is git branch m main like you will mostly notice two type of branch main and master they are nothing but the version like you can upload your first version of the code onto the main and the sec second version of your code onto the master so i will choose main so just set it to main the third step is to set where to upload your code this thing you have to do only once so i had already set now this is the last command git push you origin main so the my branch is main like my, my first version is main if you have chosen it master then you have to write here master instead of main so when i click ok and you can see here it has been uploaded successfully so now i will come here refresh this so now you can see here that all my code has been uploaded successfully. In this way, you can upload any code and whenever you make changes in your project directory, just run all this command except this one, git remote, because it sets the path and we have to set it only once. Now we have to host this website. So for that, you have to go to settings. In that, you, have, you can come to pages. Here, in branch, just choose your branch. Mine is main. Click on save. And once it is done, it will take around two to three minutes to generate the link. So we can just wait for that. Now you can see here that after two to three minutes, our page is generated. It is saying your site is live at this. So if we have to visit our website, then just click on this link. I will open this link and you can see here. This is my fo form which is on my XAMPP folder and this is my form which is on my GitHub. So in this way, you can easily host your HTML website on GitHub. Okay. Only remember to host the HTML website, not the PHP one. For PHP, you can host it in Heroku. That's it for this video. And if you found this video helpful, then please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.